Okay, so let's do a factor factor reset with external keys or hard reset on this Moto G6 Forza Quick from Cricket. Uh, first, the phone must be powered off, and we can remove any external memory card to save some files stored in this in the memory on the on the SD card or external memory card. Okay, this purpose is to remove any password, pattern, or pin blocking the screen of the phone or a Google account. But um, it is very very important that you have to know your email and password associated with the phone right now because after the factory reset. You will require to confirm or verify Google in order to proceed and get to the home screen. Okay, so just so you know, it's very very important that you know that. So let's go and start with the phone power off. You're gonna use volume down and power key. You're gonna press these two buttons together at the same time, and as soon as the um, I mean Motorola logo appears, release both keys, and they're gonna proceed. Gonna proceed from there. Okay, volume down and power. Logo appears, release two buttons. Now using volume down, let's go and scroll uh, options. So let's go and find recovery mode. And once you are in recovery mode, just uh, press the power key. Uh, Motorola logo appears. In a few seconds you're gonna see another option there you go so now uh, no command and the uh, android package is on the phone let's go and press um, the volume down and power key for six seconds and after the six seconds on the seven second let's go and press the um, volume up key and uh, just for one second and release and then um, we want to see a recovery menu with the blue letters on the screen then release um, volume down and power key okay so volume down and power at the same time and press properly okay one two three four five six seven and release okay so now we are we have a recovery menu and with the options to do a factor reset using volume down and select wipe data factory reset now press the power key and uh, next step is to confirm so even we already talked about that everything is going to be deleted like pictures videos contacts um, email web history downloaded applications like like games uh, and any other applications so everything is going to be deleted on the phone yeah, so if you agree with that and then just uh, highlight yes and then press the power key okay and with your google account after the factory reset you will be able to restore with the same google account okay so don't worry about it and well as far as you need a backup with your google account all your phone content now using volume down let's go and highlight so if you choose user data only and if your issue is with uh, for uh, that you forgot your password panel or pin blocking the screen uh, this option won't remove those issues on the screen um, only user data like pictures like I'm sorry like uh, web history downloaded applications and any other personalized con uh, feature you set up on your phone and user data plus second one second option is the one that you wanna um, remove the lock screen that you forgot and then so that you need that to choose the second option for that okay so just uh, highlight that and press power key and at the bottom of the phone you're gonna see wiping data formatting data and then complete so last step automatically highlight the reboot system now press power key to reboot the phone and then here it's going to take a few minutes probably some five to eight minutes for the phone to work properly and take us to the initial setup screen where we can um, okay so or you can choose the language of the phone and then continue to get the home screen okay thanks and also in case that 
your phone gets stuck on the Motorola logo or Cricut logo that means that something is wrong with the motherboard so uh, you can long press the power key to power off the screen and then start over again with the same process using volume down and power key the same steps that we did at the beginning of the video Hello. okay the thing is that sometimes um, we overload information on the phone like overload like um, games or any other applications and or music and then you we fail to reboot the phone at least three times a month and that's when the motherboard gets uh, stuck with so many information and the motherboard um, it, it stops working properly so um, if you experience drop calls or your phone just go off sometimes this is the question this is the problem too so just so you know this is maybe an option to fix your phone in case you have problems with it but make sure to do a backup okay copy all your informations on your Google account okay so now we are on the initial setup screen so you need a factory reset or you buy this phone to as a new phone uh, these are the languages that you can use on the phone so uh, you probably may I'm looking for like which languages you can use on the phone on the Motorola G6 Forge from Cricut so uh, let's go and choose a language right so you already we are only in English so just uh, hit the let's go button and the first option is copy your data if you have existing Google account you can enter Google account to retrieve all any um, information on the new phone or the second option is set up a new phone so um, to open a new account with Google okay since there is no SIM card on this phone to detect data so they uh, it asking to um, register a Wi-Fi but if you already have an uh, active SIM card, go ahead and insert it on the phone. For now, you're going to skip the step as far as this phone doesn't have anything registered yet. About privacy, accept and continue. Otherwise, they want us uh, let us continue. And uh, first option here, select your time zone. A second option is a uh, date. So on the top, you can move to change the month and then select the day. And then hit the OK button to save. And uh, the clock here. Um, so this is the hour. Okay, you need to change the hour, uh, minutes, and you can choose AM or PM. So hit the next button to continue. A uh, nickname for the phone in case that you lost your phone and um, the people that finds the phone after so many attempts they may guess your lock screen such as password pattern or pin and google automatically will consider the phone has been compromised uh, so they're going to ask them to verify a nickname for the phone to continue okay so 98 percent of the cases they won't pass this step because this is a name a nickname that only you know and and you may never forget because uh, in case you won't never use it unless you forget your lock screen credentials then this is another option to unlock your phone so uh, just uh, choose a nickname that only you remember and hit the next button to continue okay so unlock with fingerprints and you can set up this now or you can skip the step and once you get to the settings you will be able to um, use uh, set up that okay location with google services i recommend you to leave the three steps the first second and third because um, every every single time you go to google to search any item the first result you gonna that you're gonna get is the one that is on your locations phones locations so leave everything on so you can take advantage of every single browse from google and they are awesome okay so uh, Marola terms and conditions just agree you can choose email 
your, you can leave your email address so you can receive a notification from Motorola in case you have like there is a update for your Android or any other um, good news for your phone so just hit the next button when you are ready with that for now I'm gonna leave I'm okay with it I won't leave any oops like I have to set I mean okay click it terms and conditions user agreement I agree otherwise you won't be able to get to the home screen okay so this is the home screen of this Motorola uh, G6 Forge from Cricut. Please subscribe to my channel. Let me know if you have any other questions or any other of these issues that you may have, like TalkBack or um, set up your lock screen or just a factory reset or you forget your password, pattern, or PIN, blocking the screen of the phone. Just find me other tutorials related to this smart smartphone on my channel. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button and share my video on your social page for your friends thanks so much